Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Diesel Brothers the Truck Building Simulator. We have just finished up our break, so we can get straight back to rebuilding trucks and testing them on the tracks. I see, look, you've, you've actually got like um, a breakdown of what the tyres are like. These are all just grey. These have got a breakdown of what they're like, so you get they get better and better. So really, we should have gone for something a bit better than what we got right now. That's that's fine. We'll, we'll just go with that. And those are going to be delivered in a little while, so I can't put those back on yet. But that that's fine. It doesn't we don't actually need to get those delivered yet? I've done the other bits back up again. So we go to management. We will go to transfer, and we will go to storage. That one. Actually, I just want to put that one up there. And I go back to storage again. That one. I put that one up there as well. Put you on. Ah, that's what I wanted. There. There we go. We got all of our blue back. So now if I lower it down a bit. And I'll start doing up. The, there were several screws all the way around that we left. Where did I throw the... Where's, where's my drill? Oh, chucked it over here. Right. I'm very clean and tidy when I'm working in my workshop, as you can all see. So we'll do that one up. You've only got four bolts for the bed. That's nice and easy. The cab on the front, that's got a few more bolts to do up. But we'll go. We'll make sure that we get all of these done up here first. And then we will, once we've done this bit there, so we put those on. We'll now go round to the cab and we'll start doing these up. I got one right there, and I got one down there. So there's two underneath there, and then we've also got... Right, there should be... Ah, there's one. We've got one right there on the front of the cab. It's actually very, very easy to take a cab on and off. Got one right there. And then back over this way, I've got one under there, and then I've got one just behind the seat over there. So there's the cab put on. And the back bit put on as well. Next, I want to reinstall the bumper. I'll do bumpers front and back. Like this. There, put you on. And I will also put the lights. Uh, that one's over that side. And then that light is on that side. And then I've got lights over here. One up there, and I've got one up there. So let's grab you and do up these bolts on here. So there's one there to do. And one there to do as well. That's it for the bumper. Come around to the back, and I'll do the same. We've got two on this one. And then we can start putting all those panels back on. All the panels, all of the doors. We're getting the deliveries turning up now. One of them is already here. So we've got one door right there. I'll put all four doors on. Put that one. And i got a door right there. I'll run around this side and put that one on. And then I've got a door right there. I'll run around. And I'll put that one on. And then I'll come over to here. And we will start doing up these bolts. So I've got... Oh, I want to be around this side of the pillar. There is one. And up is there's the next one and then i've got two over this side we'll, once we've done once we put the truck back together we'll take it we do have a playground we do have a thing that we can like go and have a little bit of a drive around we don't have the off-road track or anything like that yet but we're working on it we need 5,000 fans i think to get the off-road track we're on 2,944 right now actually i need to go to the front to get that one there uh, completing an order gets us a huge number of fans. I'm wondering what we get when we sell a completed truck. That's kind of the next thing I'm very, very curious about, is how many fans are we going to pick up by completing this truck right here? So let's put those up, and then we want to look around. So it's just these two up here to do this one up. One there, and one over there. I don't think there is anything else for the fender. Nope. So we come around to this side, and I get the same onto here. And then we've got the little bits around the light. I think those just go on without any bolts being done up. We'll do those next. Uh, that one right there. 
goes on. And yeah, I don't think there is actually anything on that one. You can come on to the back. Go back up onto there. I'm missing. Oh, no, it's right there. It's that bit. There it is. We've got it. Don't worry. We've got it. We found it. And let me just grab you a minute. Right, no, there's definitely nothing around that one, but this one back here, we do have four bolts we've got to do up. Uh, one there and one there, and then the same on the other side. And that's the same with the bonnet that we'll also have to do in a minute. And then we can close that one up. There we go, that's done. Close that one up. It's looking good. It's actually looking quite good now. Very pleased with our work here. The grill, that one does have some bolts to do up. Where are they? One up there. Screw that grill down there. And there's another one. Oh, so we got four on the front grill. There's actually more on the grill than I thought there'd be. Another new order has turned up. We won't worry about orders at the moment. We'll leave those. And then I've got this one to go up on there like that. Let's take you and do that one up. So that's the last of these to do up. We've then got to go and put these wheels on. And those are it's another sort of slow-ish bit to do, that is, putting the wheels. Which is why I don't really want to undo too much off of any truck. Because of how long it takes to do these bolts up. And I, I don't really like that. This is one aspect of it that I'm finding that I don't like. Is it takes too long to do anything up. So let's lift that up into the air. Let's go up a little bit higher. So that we're working at head height. That's good. And... <laughs> ah, perfectly balanced right there. Let's go and put these on. And... Okay, that one's perfectly balanced as well up in the sky. And then... Oop, put that one on as well. And it doesn't look like it's going to be ripping itself to shreds on anything there. Which is really good. And we take you... You can come out and go on there. And... Yeah. Chuck it. Just just, just take it and chuck it. Seems to be just fine doing that. There we go. We'll just do it like that. And then take you and chuck you over there. Uh, as long as the wheels... As long as the tyres don't sort of rush off too far, we should be fine doing it like that. And I'll take you... I'll carry you over. I'll be a bit more elegant with that one. Um... 100% quality. I, got, I just got to make sure that we're picking up the right ones now. That is 20%, so you can go over there. Uh, that one I want over here on that side. And then I've got that tyre to come over onto there. That tyre right there to go onto there. And finally, I got that tyre to go onto there. And then I want you. And we need to start doing these up. So we've got... Oh, wait, is that the right one? Let me just... 20% quality. As another one at 20% quality. You are 20% quality. And... There should be one more. There's two here. 20 and 20. 20 and... 20. That was 20. Yeah, okay. That's fine. I'm just looking at it because on here, look, it, it looks like it's got flex on the actual wheel. And it, it sort of looked a bit like maybe it wasn't up to maximum quality, which I thought that's not really good. That's not really very good. We don't want that. Excuse me. Yeah, we, we definitely don't want that. Um, so now the, the decoration on the truck, is that going to make any difference to people that watch? Are they? Uh, is it going to make any difference to the price? Like if I go and put some stickers on the truck, are they going to be really impressed with that? Or are they just going to want you know a plain colored truck like it is? Personally, I would just go for a plain one like this. I, I've always, you know, I, I like sort of the, the minim minimalist approach rather than anything too drastic. We'll have to see about that. That one up there. One more wheel to go. And then we've got our truck. It's looking good. There's the final wheel. That down there. And then we will lower this bad boy down onto the ground. There. Right. There is our truck all done up and looking schnazzy. Right. Now we want to go and actually test this truck out. We've got 
Actually, let's have a look at our marketing a minute campaign over here. Um, go to active. Fans acquired 923. 27.5 cost per fan. Five days. I think we, well, we said seven days. We've got no money left at the moment. Oh, uh, trucks. How do you sell a truck? Something that I'm not sure about. How do I actually go and sell a truck? Uh, part shop, sell. I can sell these items right here. Those are in very poor condition, so I will sell those. 19% quality. Um, climber, small, 19. There, those. I got a spare climber, small, at 100%. So, trucks, sale, manage. Let's try management. Fan rewards, garage up. Fan rewards. Uh, I don't want that one. Come back out. Marketing giveaway. All trucks. I have a truck. Why can't I give it away? Apparently, I'm not allowed to give away my truck. Okay, well, it's probably not the best thing to go and do, to give away our truck. But it does imply that we could do it. Set the number of days. I got nothing else in here, so I don't, I don't really know what to do with that. Um, trucks, right there. Price, starting at the bottom, 16,000 right there. Uh, how do I sell mine? I don't actually know how to sell If I press tab, maybe? If I go up to it and press tab? Nope. Right. Okay, I will go... Right here to map, you've got backyard, you've got auction right there, decal, off-road, playground. Yes, I want to travel to the playground. Vehicle is in operate area. That one. Race. What? It's in operate area. Um, E. So what am I supposed to... Uh, am I supposed to transfer it? to somewhere else first. Maybe I'm supposed to move it. Uh, management. Transfer. Select to show parts. I don't want to select to show parts. What's that? Part hold. Oh, that's a part holder right there. So you can go and work on stuff. And we see. Right, you make the garage much bigger. Storage. I want to move it to the backyard. So I want to put you... Transfer to slot A in the backyard. Like that. So I've got my truck back there. Trucks. I don't have anything for selling. Fan rewards. No, no, it wasn't that. It wasn't on there. It was marketing. Give. Ah, right. Value 28,000. So we've actually increased the value of it. And set the number of days. I can give this one away if I want to. I don't really want to give it away. I'd, I'd, I'd like to go and, and drive it on... Oh, go on the... I can't go on the off-road race or the drag race, but I can go to the playground, I think, and race. Okay, we're going to the playground with our truck that we've done a bit of work on. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Am I supposed to be changing gear or something? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I actually got no clue at all what I'm supposed to be doing, but you know, it's it it's working. I'm 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 doing something. I'm going through mud. I'm going over jumps. I'm destroying my own wheels by the look of it. Through the flaming hoop! I don't think that's quite going to work. Right. There's a flaming hoop up there. I want to get through that. So we're going to try and get through that flaming hoop. I'll go back up this way. Up over there, like that. Come around here. Um... If I got up and down gear, handbrake, look behind, reset, turbo, shift. Oh, I got turbo for shift. Right. Oh, nice. 
straight through there and boom. <laughs> this thing just doesn't seem to want to go. I'm not quite sure. Am I supposed to be changing up and down a gear or something? I'm not, I, I, I'm not quite sure what it's doing. Uh, I think I'm supposed to be trying to change up and down a gear, but I don't have anything to change up and down a gear with. And I mean, it, it's fun driving around here. There's no denying that. It, it is a little bit of fun. Oh. <laughs> I'm not very good at it, mind. I think it's time to go back. I think it's time to leave. I, th I think we've done our bit. So, yes, I want to travel back to the garage. And we've got our truck out the back. I got 3,100 fans. So let me go to management a minute. Transfer. Uh, we've got in the backyard, I've got that one right there. How do I sell it? Sandblasting, paint shop, decal, storage, garage. Do I need to go to the auction? I, I don't know how to sell the vehicle. This is not something that's come up. Trucks sale right there. Search price. Right, that's that's no good to me. Maybe I need to go. Maybe I need to go into the back. Maybe I need to go out back. Let's go and have a look. Let's go out to the backyard and see if we can find our truck out here. Where is it? Where is my truck? Spent all that time working on that truck. It better be out here. I'm a little bit concerned because I don't see it here. And this is more than a little bit. Con let's, let's go back indoors. Where's my truck gone? It's a great and terrible mystery has occurred. We've lost the truck. We've completely lost our truck. I need I, I need to have my truck back. Where, where Where is it? Where is my truck? Management. Transfer. Uh, backyard. Transfer here. Slot E. Slot A. What difference does that make? I don't really know. I suppose I could move it into here if I wanted to. Let me go and have another look and we'll see if it is out here. We transferred it back to slot A. Um, maybe it was... Oh, it might have still been at the track. Right, well, here's our truck. Right here, it's looking very cool. We've done a lot of work on this. I'm very pleased with it, but I don't actually know how to sell the truck. All right. Well, anyway, we we have we have restored a truck, and that much I'm very pleased about. I've been looking it up, and it doesn't appear that you actually sell your trucks at all. You give them away because. From what I've been told by looking up and also um, other places as well, I think it was, you know, didn't somebody say? I'm not sure, but anyway, what I've been told is that the way that the Diesel Brothers actually made their name is they would fit up the trucks and then they would give them away. That's what they actually did, right? They would take the truck that they had done and they would give the thing away in a competition. And this is what got them their big name this is how they earned all of their fans and stuff like that so if i set this one here for four days we'll give them we will do it for four days right there and we will give away this truck with it's the only one that we got we've got seventeen thousand, so we need to earn a bit of money to be able to do this up i don't know if fans equals more money i don't know if there's other ways to get money from having lots of fans but uh, I'm, I'm going to assume that it was a profitable model. If they're giving away thousands of dollars worth of trucks, let's just do that. Start. Cheap and unlocked. Give away one car. Okay. Total fans acquired so far. In the first few minutes, zero. All right. Well, let's let's just assume merchandise. Of course, once they're giving away a whole load of stuff, then you get the merchandise coming up. Uh, it's going to accumulate a lot more fans, isn't it? That's, 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 um, you kind of, you tie those two together. Our campaign up here, let's start slow. Uh, I don't worry about that. It was down here, wasn't it? This is what I was doing. Reach, money, oh, adverts. If I look here, 
Fans acquired 1,119 and... Has it been running for four days or has it got four days left? I don't really know. I really can't tell which, which way around it is with this. It's like... It's very, very plain and simple with um, the screens being able to get through everything, which I like. But at the same time, I don't like um, that it seems a little bit oversimplified. Right? It does seem a bit oversimplified. We've already gained 89 fans. I imagine, yes, you would give away uh, you give away a whole truck. That is going to get you quite a lot of fans, isn't it? As that's one way of being able to buy in a lot of fans. Somebody suggested to have a look in the shop, and I take a look at look at upgrading my impact wrench. Um, more tools in stock soon. This is what I've got: a basic impact wrench. Any vehicle, ninety. Well, I think this is one that I've got. I'm going to buy that bad boy right there. Yes. Just like that, and it doesn't have a time on it, so I'm going to assume that it's going to be here already. It's going to be a quick delivery. Ah, there we go, right, and it's easy to pick up. It looks the same. It looks identical. Right, I'm looking at these two, and they, they both look absolutely identical let's go back in here a minute and uh part shop sell right well, we'll sell one of those yes i should now only have four but apparently we can't sell back the drill so we've got the drill but we can't sell it back uh management in here fan rewards four thousand we're approaching four thousand more car parts more decoration items drag race off-road decal and then we, we get the um the other bits but i mean i wasn't that taken with i mean yes admittedly i didn't have a very good truck so that probably didn't help matters but i honestly i wasn't that taken with um the truck in general uh, with the track sorry not the truck with the track in general that one, we can earn $7,000. That one, we can earn 6000 We need to paint... Um, we need to paint everything. This load, that's all a load of painting is 5000 Mount new rear bumper and mount roof rack. Right, that's a really, really simple, easy job to do. 2300 So we'll take that one right there. We need a, a rear bumper and a roof. Let's just go straight in. We'll buy that right now. Uh, we need to go to... No. Um... Out of that one, I need to go bumper, that one there, classic rear, buy, yes, out of there, and out of there as well, extra car parts, roof rack, uh, standard, regular, that one there, buy, yes, okay, there's our bits, Just come out, and we're waiting two hours, we've got to wait for those to get here, so we've got the rear bumper, and the roof rack, wasn't it? Uh, new rear bumper, mount roof rack. So, oh, the, the bumper is not on there. We don't have a bumper. There is no rear bumper at the moment. If I take, which was the, this was the new one, wasn't it? Pick that one up. Have a look here. Um, oh. Is that, uh, well, I'm undoing these two. Let me just put that one down. That doesn't seem any faster or slower, so I'm assuming that they're exactly the same. There. I'll drop that one back up onto there, and... Right, it does come off. The other one does come off. We'll drop that down there. And we're just kind of waiting around for that one now. We've got 3,600 fans at the moment. I don't really know how much more of this I'm going to do. Right, I, I'm. Uh, how much more of this series I'm going to do? How much longer I'm going to spend on here? Mainly, why is that lit up like that? Okay, I don't know why that bit was lit up. Um, I feel that we've looked at a lot of what this game has already got to offer, and like, there's not a huge amount of complexity with stripping these vehicles down. Uh, so you know, it, it keeps everything relatively simple. Um. So I'm thinking I'm probably not going to do all that much more here. Uh, that has cost 10000 I could unlock that so we could have two jobs going at once. Transmission. Replacing the transmission, you need to have proper equipment, just like our transmission jack. 
That's 10,000 as well. I'll, I'm going to leave that a minute. Let me have a look at the, um, no, let me have a look at, let's have a look at the marketing, the giveaway, how we're doing. 322 fans on that one. That's doing quite nicely. And orders. There was another new order in here. The, the problem I got with the orders is, is all painting and it takes so long to take everything off and then go and do all the painting. That one there though, right exhaust resonator from the shop, uh, left injectors and then four tires. I can't take it because I don't have the, the thing, but I can, I can, I can, I can, I can go here. I can go um, garage upgrades and I can buy slot B, yes. That one's 40 grand, I don't have the money for that. But I can just go and, actually I don't want to put it in there because it's the tires. Uh, well, I've, I've got the bits, so I can go and do that one first. I don't have the bits, I thought I had the bits. Let me move that one a minute. Management, transfer, move you to slot B like that. Then come out of there and uh, go back to orders and go to that one right there. Wait, why can't I take that one? Reject, confirm. E, confirm. Am I only allowed to take one at a time? Apparently I'm only allowed to take one order at a time. Seems a little bit odd. Right, well, we'll run down here and we will put this bumper on. Here we go. And I will go up here and there it is. There's that one. I'll have that and I'll put that one on the roof. Run you down here and put you right up on there. Uh, yeah, so, like, I, I feel that we've looked at a lot of what the game has got to offer already. I don't really want to spend ages in this game just repeating everything over and over and over so we will spend maybe we'll look at another truck or two and do a few more jobs but then i'm going to be moving on to pastures new and at the moment i'm most likely going to go back to a series that i looked at a little while ago which is surviving mars because there's been quite a significant update on there now. You're no longer limited to just living inside a load of domes. Um, they've now got where you can terraform the whole planet. Which, quite frankly, I think is a rather wonderful, amazing thing. Which I would like to do. Okay, so if I finish that order right there. Income, fans change, 474. 3,500 on there. That is absolutely brilliant. So that would be wise because you press tab and that's the... Order, you get the other one unlocked so that you can have a vehicle that you're doing up at the same time as doing the orders. At least this is what I'm assuming. So that one's a load of painting. This one here, we want four tires, uh, left injectors, and there. And I can take the job now. So I want left injectors and tires. So we want to go here to the engine and injectors. Uh, regular left injectors. I'm going to go with those. I'm not going to bother going with the premium ones. Uh, buy those right there. Yes. And I come out and out of that one. And I'm going to go to the exhaust system. A resonator vessel. Let's go with the slightly bigger one. I had somebody explain what the resonator is for. That's the tone. Um, the muffler quiets it down a little bit. Oh, no. I don't want that. I want wheels and tires. As much fun as it is rebuilding trucks and testing them on the tracks, occasionally we need some coffee. We have a secret stash over here, don't tell anybody else. While we have some coffee, if you've enjoyed the episode, then please hit down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.